Welcome to this week's episode of the Weekly Digest. The Alf of Alf. We're your anchors. S- and Josiah. Mm. I wonder what the different varieties of space food taste like. Probably like meteorite. And now the weekly. Grinders, hoagies and grinders, navy beans, navy beans, meatloaf sandwich, sloppy dough, slap, sloppy dough. Do you like the school food? No. That was a joke. Sure, yes, I guess. Carl, what you eating? Goldfish. What's in your food? Lettuce. Thank you. <laughs> Do you like the food? Oh, I love it, man. It, it hits me right here in the heart. Feel good. <laughs> Have you had the school food? Not lately. When you had it, did you like it? Yeah. There's some things they have that are really good. Gracie, Gracie, how's the food? Everything but the crust is good. Hey, hey Hadley, how do you like the school food? Uh, some of it's good and some of it's terrible. My name is Maximilian. Do you like it yourself? Yes. What do you like about it? I like that there's not people that's out to get you and people are more accepting. Do you play any sports? No, but I am talking to my parents about if I can see if I can try out for football. This is a Roman's creature. And this is Josiah's creature. Welcome back to Creature Feature. This week's theme is Star Wars. This is Sunny. And this is Geo. Sunny won last week's Creature Feature vote. Be sure to submit to Creature Feature. We'd love to see your pictures and videos. Is Mr. Morgan a forest user? Hmm. Possibly.
My name is Miss Pemberton. What do you teach and where are you located at South? Well, I'm a co-teacher here and I teach Comarts, Reading and Social Studies and my room is room 303. What is your favorite color? My favorite color is blue. When was the last time you were on a plane? The last time I've been on a plane was in March and we went to Orlando. Good side or bad side? Bad side. Have you ever seen Star Wars? Uh, not the whole thing, just a little bit. So I guess no, yeah, maybe, I don't know. Thank you for letting me interview you today. <laughs> Thank you for having me, have a great day. Did you know that a long time ago, in a galaxy far away? Dun dun. Back to random history fact. Do you know how most movies start with this? put the credits at the beginning, but Star Wars was the first movie in history to put the credits at the end and begin with this sequence title that we all know. George Lucas was actually fined ten or one hundred thousand dollars for this. And this is Random History Fact. Thirty-five ways to use the force. One, lightning. Two, pushing. Three, pulling. Four, choking. Flying. Welcome back to 35 Essentials. Today we are talking about Essential 10. If someone bumps into you, even if it was not your fault, say excuse me. See how the ducks said excuse me when the ducks bumped into each other? This is what essential number 10 is about. Did you know that Harrison Ford was cast as Han Solo by accident? Superstar Wars. Always do that to me. <gasps> Well, I nominated Sierra for Superstar Student because she is always there to lend anybody a helping hand in my classroom. And it doesn't matter who they are or what they need help with, she offers it and nobody even has to ask. Just help each other out and be kind. The seven forms of lightsaber combat are each artful in their own unique way. Team Purple Lightsaber. Why?
Hoshmut. That's I'm drum, but uh, Hoshmut. Maybe that. Hello. Hello. Ich bin. Ich bin. And your name? Uh, Sam. Okay, so say it all together. Hello, ich bin Sam. Perfect. Mi nombre, mi nombre es, es, and then you say your name, Allison. Okay, so you say it all together. Hola, mi nombre es Allison. Perfect. The principal of your school is either a Darth Vader or an Obi Wan Kenobi. Luckily, we have an Obi Wan Kenobi. How you doing? So, uh, I'm supposed to talk a little bit about Star Wars, and my goodness, I have loved Star Wars since I was a little kid. Uh, I remember sitting down on my front porch and playing my, in my little Star Wars action figures, and, and uh, nah, that was fun. I still have some of them, but, uh, you know, there's a ton of Star Wars universe um, books, and Mrs. Gilbert has a bunch in the library, but there are a ton of things out there. And if you get a chance, the Timothy Zahn series, his little story arc is really, really good. Um, good time to talk to you also about making sure that your grades are up. We've also, we've got, you know, testing coming up. Guys, need your best effort on that. It's really, really important. Uh, you guys are capable of so much, and I'd like to see that on the test. Just staying focused and getting through that, doing it well. So I'm anticipating good things there. Um, and th there's just a lot of stuff running through my head right now. So anyway, I hope the testing we have done is going well. Look forward to seeing how things turn out. Stay after it for next week, and I will talk to you later. Did the wizard Satan Jackson wizard. learn his powers wizard. from a Sith Lord or a Jedi? Good day, faithful followers. In honor of Star Wars Day, you're all invited to our to tour room 104 at South Mill School. Have a great week. It's the true game. It's the true game end now. It's Trigerman. Trigerman game now. Trigerman game. Trigerman. Trigger Trigerman. Trigerman. Trigger Trigerman. Trigger, 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 man. Hey Siri, when does a trend cease to be a trend?
Oh no, it's a meteor. Kaboom. Like, was a great war general because he committed like a hundred war crimes. Wait, isn't that a bad thing? Hello again, everyone. This week's words of wisdom are learn the value of money and start saving. It's never too early to save. Remember what Ben Franklin said, a penny saved is a penny earned. If you're smart, you'll let your money work for you. Thanks and have a great day. This week the theme is Star Wars, and Star Wars is a great movie. I think that uh, it's actually a really fun idea to have a movie be the theme. So next week, in honor of Mr. Morgan, I think we should have Dumb and Dumber week. I have the high ground. I know this planet, I know these suns, I know this desert we both come from. I was the chosen one. Are you the chosen one? And I could fix anything and fly anything straight right out of here. It's easier said than done. When you're this young, my ambition won't wait. And I'm certain that you can relate. Cause I am your father. And I rule this galaxy. I am your father. And you could come join me. Your feelings, Luke, it's true. I am your father. I'm your father. I'm your father. And now I know you're training. I did the same thing, so pay attention now. This is your destiny. You're just like me. Indeed, you are as powerful as the emperor has foreseen. The force is strong in our family. It's pointless to resist the dark side. Come join me, Obi-Wan never told you Search your feelings, Luke, it's true I am your father, I'm your father I'm your Josiah? Yes? Even though you did not say any dad jokes this week Yes Which is kind of an accomplishment Because yes. they make me physically recoil Whenever they well, originate from wrong. your mouth you're physically But We all both know that I have the ultimate high ground so, to teach you a lesson, you must go to the corner. This is high ground, and I have it. All right, so here we are. We're driving around here. No, we're in space now. No, we're in space. Sometimes I forget when I'm in space because I'm a little spacey, and that's okay.
in space. Yeah. In Kelser's Corner. And we're getting ready for map testing. It's or we already it's are map testing. One of the two things are happening with map. Yeah. Make sure you get a good grade. Map testing is very important. Be sure you eat an important breakfast in <laughs> Make sure even if you're in space that you get plenty of that sleep. Read a book. This one's about small moons like the Death Star. Oh! My book is Red Rover by Christopher Kabaden. They shouldn't have stopped the car. When Amy sees a dog stranded on the side of the highway, she knows what she has to do. She tells her dad to stop the car. She can't understand why anyone would abandon a dog in such a way, tied up and blindfolded. Amy's parents say they only keep the dog until they can find him a new home. Amy's younger sister names the dog Rover. They take Rover into their house, their family, and once he's there, he doesn't want to leave. Amy loves dogs, but she starts to worry when strange things begin to happen in the house. Objects move, lights go off, accidents happen. Soon, man's best friend has turned into Amy's worst nightmare. The problem isn't Rover's bark or bite, it's even creepier than that. This dog's purpose is evil and it's waiting to be unleashed. What does a Jedi use to open a PDF file? I know where this is going. An Adobe One Kenobi! My favorite Star Wars character is Obi Wan Kenobi. My favorite Star Wars character is General Grievous. Darth Vader. My favorite Star Wars character is the debate between Anakin Skywalker, aka Darth Vader, and C3PO. Um, Baby Yoda. My favorite Star Wars character is Obi Wan Kenobi. Uh, Kylo Ren. Dun 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 This week's theme was uh, Star Wars, so all the Star Wars songs, and this is my lightsaber. You're, you're this is my lightsaber. Oh. Don't do anything. Just announce the winner. The winner of it. That person on the lightsaber. He's got good balancing skills. Yeah, he's just like dancing right, right here. Right, right, yeah, right on here. How does he not getting cut by the lightsaber? I don't know. You know, it really blinds you in a fight. Confetti. Don't try it. No. Confetti's not your father, Emmett. Confetti's not your father, Emmett. It's not me either. Yeah, I just don't know who your dad is. No. Oh. You can submit right here. Right here. Submit your guesses. Emmett wants them very dearly. So that I can do more confetti. <laughs> no, bad confetti. Confetti burn force abilities. Confetti bad. No, I win. You're out of frame. 
I have one, and it's bad. With your guesses next week, tell us who won that lightsaber duel. Yes. Just know Emmett's about to be shanked. Emmett has been shanked. This isn't over. Do you know what Sith Lightning is? This is Sith Confetti. <laughs> Sith Confetti. I'm, I'm the one with the red lightsaber. Nice. Ah! <laughs> <laughs> Got you! <laughs> Ranged. <laughs> now I have a cool scar. I have a cool uh, scar. I have scar powers. Now I have plot armor. <laughs> Roman, did you know that if you put a rock in orbit, it is a moon now? I like turtles. Yeah. Well, I like knowledge. Did you know that Yoda was almost played by a monkey? Selfie. My phone case. Who is Teddy? Or do you want better? Yeah. Why is Teddy? Well, do you want better? Where is Teddy? Probably in Antarctica. No, he's not. Stop lying. He's in Antarctica. No, he's not. Oh my, my, this here Anakin guy made Someday later, now he's just a small fry And he left his home and kissed his mommy goodbye Saying soon I'm gonna be a Jedi Soon I'm gonna be a Jedi Did you know this junkyard slave isn't even old enough to shave But he can use the force, they say Well, we've got a couple of events next week in case you didn't notice. Tuesday is school's nurse day. So yeah. And then Wednesday and Thursday are map testing days. As well as Tuesday. And Tuesday. Yes. I said Tuesday. Yes. No, you didn't, but alright. <laughs> okay, so get your map testing ready, get some sleep, and eat fall some in the toilet. Don't fall in the toilet. No, definitely fall in the toilet. Do not fall in the toilet. Are you ready for this? This is going to be loud. Roman, how, how you feeling about your jump today? Oh, I'm gonna make it. What are you, what are you aiming, what height are you aiming for? The ceiling. The ceiling? The ceiling tiles up there? About how high do you think you have to jump to hit those? 100 feet. 100 feet. 100 feet. All right, guys, let's, let's see it. All right, Roman! <laughs> to not touch the ceiling. <laughs>